you're watching in January. If you're not watching in January, then click off whenever if you don't want to watch it. You don't want to watch it. Hi, Happy New Year. Hope everyone had a peaceful Christmas and a joyous New Year's Eve and is enjoying 2020 so because it's January this is going to be a January upload which means any money I hope this video gets monetized if it doesn't then thanks YouTube but there's no reason why it shouldn't um, which means all my money from this month all my ad revenue and stuff like that is being donated to charity so please watch the entire video even if you get bored of the workout because the money will be going to charity from this video if you're watching in january if you're not watching in january then click off whenever if you don't want to watch it you don't want to watch it so today's video is a in-depth glute workout i say in depth what it means is i'm just going to explain it i've had some feedback my last video that i did my last workout video i just put the clips together because people said it was quite um jarring slash annoying which i get um just constantly cutting between the workout clips and me sat in my car and then when i did the clips just all together with music over them people were like oh we kind of still want an explanation so i'm going to i'm recording this intro now and then i'm just going to do a voiceover for the workout itself it's an intense glute workout it is actually my current glute workout um, and I filmed it during my actual session yesterday so the weights and everything are what I was using um, yeah any videos that people want to see throughout this month let me know and I hope you enjoy the workout if you do get a bit <laughs> If you do give it a go, then uh, comment down below, message me on Instagram, let me know. Follow me on Instagram because I've actually started po posting more fitness content on there now. Getting ready for some exciting stuff that's going to happen this year. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoy the workout and find this video helpful. So the first exercise is hip thrusts. These are a staple in any of my glute workouts. Um, as you'll see when I'm doing the sets, I'm keeping my chin tucked. I've given a lot more in-depth um, pointers on these in my previous videos when I've spoken about hip thrusts. So if you've not watched them, I do suggest watching them. Um, and I'm doing these as a pyramid set, which I've taken from Brett Contreras, his specific pyramid set, which means I've picked a weight I can do for 15 reps, I've picked a weight I can use for 10, a weight I can use for 5, and a weight I can use for 20. And week on week, I'm trying to do more reps with the same weight. I'm not changing the weight, and I'm pushing for progressive overload with the reps using his pyramid set. So the second exercise is cable pull throughs. I did three sets of 15 for these and basically you just want to hinge your hips back and drive forwards with your glutes, putting the cable attachment right at the bottom, so on like a one or a two. Uh, when you are pulling the weight forwards, make sure that you are thrusting it forwards with your glutes and not just pulling with your arms. And also just make sure that you're not hyperextending when you get to the top, so you're not over extending your back when you are squeezing your glutes. To drive the weight through i hate doing this voiceover um so the third exercise is bulgarian split squats i did three sets of eight on each leg for these if you want to feel them more in your glutes it helps to take a slightly wider stance so your front leg should be a bit further in front of the bench and coming down at a diagonal angle rather than being more upright but everyone's different so try it <laughs> everyone's different so try different stances and stuff like that out and see what works for you and how you feel it best in your glutes but that's what I'd recommend next exercise is goblet squats so make sure that you're keeping your elbows inside your knees stance wise it's up to you you can do these sumo but I personally prefer doing them just a lot more neutral my feet are pretty wide but they're not too wide keeping my elbows inside my knees and pushing through my heels to feel it in my glutes I did four sets of 10 on those and then I'm using the abduction machine to do a drop set. I've actually realised watching this I'm only doing seven reps on each weight. You're meant to do 10 reps on each weight. I don't know what I was thinking. Can I even count, you know? Um, so yeah, you're going to do 10 reps on a heavier weight, 10 reps on a moderate weight and then 10 reps on a lighter weight. So that's 30 reps in total and two sets on the abduction machine. And then to finish off, I just did a little band burnout. So the first movement is lying on your back with your head off the floor, but your shoulders are still touching the floor um, and you're just abducting out with a band above, just above your knees. 
I then went straight into leaning up slightly on my elbows and doing the same again for another 20 reps and then I go straight up onto leaning on my hands so I'm a lot more upright and 20 reps again so that's 60 reps in total 20 each stance and I did that twice so that's two sets of 60 basically um, and that was just a little burnout that I did at the end <sighs> I don't even know if that voiceover has worked well i'll know when i add it in it if it's worked or not if it hasn't worked then i'm sorry um it felt really weird doing that voiceover i'm not sure <laughs> i'm not sure how i feel about it let me know how you prefer the workouts to be formatted and stuff because i am still very much working things out um yeah i'm not sure if that voiceover will be up to scratch i don't feel like i have gone in as depth is it, i don't feel like i've gone in as much depth as i have in previous workout videos where i have just put the clips in over myself talking um but that's how a voiceover works that's how it's going to work so yeah that is the full glute workout like i said if you give it a go then let me know i have a back workout filmed i'm going to do the voiceover and stuff for that now and that will be up next week so that will be the next video that i upload i'm also thinking of doing a vegan what i eat in a day because i've had quite a few girls message me who are vegan asking if i have any recommendations for getting protein in and stuff it's not something i've looked into before but I will definitely do that if I do end up doing a full day of eating vegan on my bulk. So if people want to see that, then let me know because I might film that next week for the week after. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching. I hope this video was helpful. Follow me on Instagram, like I said, because I have started for because <laughs> I have started posting some fitness content on there now. Um, but yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.